How can you improve your inventory management? AI-based inventory management is more efficient and agile. And the way we teach the AI to understand your inventory environment is through reinforced learning. Think of chess. Each move on the chessboard can lead to several possible outcomes. The AI agent decides a move, and the possible outcomes are calculated. If the move is good, the agent gets a reward, if not, a penalty. Over a period of time, the AI agent is trained, and it can make good decisions in unforeseen situations. How does this translate into inventory management? Here, the rules are determined by demand and supply factors. The decisions that the agent takes pertain to ordering. What to order, when to order, and how much to order. Both demand and supply side uncertainties exist. As a result of a certain ordering pattern, the reward or penalty is awarded to the agent in the form of service levels achieved, inventory cost, holding costs, etc. This is how we train an AI agent in a virtual environment. Only once the agent is trained and passes the tests does it qualify as a trained agent. The AI agent is then put into a production environment to support inventory management decisions. Let's take a look at a demo where we compare the decisions made by a trained AI agent against a statistical approach. One of the first things that we see here is a forecast. We have a trained AI agent here, and we are going to compare how it fares against a statistical approach. Demand forecasting is an important signal for the reinforcement learning model. We use several data sets to improve demand forecasting using an ML model. The lead time is also constantly changing, and the AI model can deal with varying lead times. With these variabilities, we will see how the AI model and the formula-based approach react over 108 weeks. The red lines here are the orders and the quantities produced by the formula, and the green ones are from the AI model. The AI model is ordering lower quantities more frequently. Here, you see the stock on hand with both the approaches with respect to the actual demand. The AI model is quicker to react to the changes and has a lower stock on hand. In terms of the service level, both the AI model and the formula-based ordering have some misses, but the AI model is performing better. In most cases, coverage is lesser with the AI model. Based on the summarized KPIs over 108 weeks, the AI model reduces the inventory by 30%. Moreover, this reduced coverage does not impact the cost of service level. The AI model can balance the KPIs so that one KPI is not traded for the other. There is an improvement in important KPIs concurrently. Nagaro, augmenting your inventory management with AI.